right before my mom passed, I had sold something to the Tribune in Philadelphia. It's a black-owned newspaper, but they published my work, and I became a published artist, essentially going from amateur to pro at 17. That first step, very important. Do something monumental while you're young, while you're still young. Not only is it great to be a published guy or whatever, or an accomplished kid at 19, 17 or whatever, but it separates you out of your ordinary. You become someone special. You start thinking of yourself as somebody special. If you never think of yourself as somebody special, there's no nice way to say this. You simply cannot become someone special if you never think about it. It ain't gonna happen. I, go, I, I gotta just give it to you 100. Everybody who's done anything, like, you go, wow, dude, that's, that's crazy. That's what, they all thought that before it happened. <laughs> Everybody. Derek Jeter ain't surprised to be Derek Jeter. He totally thought that. Uh, uh, Stephen Curry was convinced he was exactly like he is a long time ago. So, when I got to college, I had that big victory from 17. And I had, a, uh, by then they were paying me too. They were paying me to do more cartoons for them. And I was in college and I went to the school newspaper like I'm here. Boom, I was very confident. Um, and the, the editor, which is also a kid when you're in college, everybody's a kid, you know what I mean? And this editor ran my stuff that Monday. I had done a cartoon called Hector that ran for the entire four years I was at Syracuse. And that obligation to do this every day, to pursue excellence, became a part of my everyday life. You guys, young people in particular, our pursuit is excellence. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Now, but hear me out, before you agree with me, because you're about to disagree with me. Uh, sometimes we think it's to be a positive black person. Like, no, it's so positive. It's so, it's so great, you're a black person, and yet you're, uh-uh. I'm better than everybody who does. I'm better than everybody who does this. Everyone, everyone who does this is worse than me. Everybody. I hate to tell you that it's awful. You hear that? You're like this guy. He's so uh, he's so cocky, so conceited. He's arrogant. No. No. Again, when Stephen Curry pulls up, he's trying to be the best ever. He's not trying to be a good, a good black basketball player. He, he is, trust me, he's convinced he's the best who's ever lived. Anybody who does anything great is striving to be the best ever at it. Now, it's a bonus that I'm black. It's a bonus. On top of being the best, I'm black. They can't ever take that from me. They, no one can take that from me. My life experiences, what may be better than everybody else at this? The pain of it. Pain is power. Pain ain't nothing to run from. University is the best thing about you. The fact you can overcome, you've been through stuff, you know what pain is when it comes? You know how to overcome and how to overachieve. Because of pain and adversity. Nothing worse than being privileged and having an easy life. There's no greater curse than that. Your troubles, all these things are preparing you and paving a way for you. Forget about me for a second. What's waiting for you is something unachievable to everybody except for you. Everybody except for you. No one's got my life story. It was set aside for me by God. 